Hey, what's up, folks? How's it going? So today I'm back again with uh, one more interesting story. And as you guys know that I share uh, all these true stories based on real incidents, okay? And I hope you will learn one or two lesson out of it. So let's start the story straight away. Uh, Subalaji was attending an important meeting and client side, uh, Matt also attending. And he said, Balaji, whatever idea you shared is brilliant. I really loved your idea. So Balaji felt certain kind of strange feeling. He looked at his boss through the corner of his eyes and he saw that his boss's smile totally disappeared from his face. So Balaji and uh, Balaji working for an American company, they manufacture, produce, distribute uh, some machineries and they distribute to uh, some global network of dealers. And they were talking with some manufacturing company and they are try trying to strike a deal with them. So from uh, Balaji's side, like Balaji, his boss Sanjay and a couple of senior folks from his company attending the meeting. And there are like a couple of guys uh, from the other side also. And uh, so they were discussing, brainstorming a lot of ideas. And it was quite obvious in the meeting that Balaji understood the requirement quite well, uh, better than his boss Sanjay. So Balaji, uh, his boss also sharing some ideas. Somehow uh, uh, the client said they didn't like, they didn't like the ideas, whatever he was sharing, but they liked Balaji's ideas pretty well. And they were appreciate, like they were appreciating that, okay, these are the very good ideas. Uh, yeah, you really understood the requirement, etc. And uh, because of that, his boss Sanjay uh, felt uh, uncomfortable and uh, uh, felt, felt insecure. So before the next meeting happened, uh, he said that uh, Balaji that some important work came up in another project and that mm, so please have a look into it. So Balaji felt a little disappointed because he felt that because of his uh, work, uh, maybe because of his contribution, he was fronted out. And uh, so he was discussing this with his friend Sanjay. Uh, I mean, it's Anupam. So Anupam said, hey, chill out, man. Uh, take it easy, man. This is this is this this will happen, man. Right? Because you are uh, sharing some ideas. The uh, other uh, side, they, they, are, uh, they are liking it. Maybe not all of them know that uh, Sanjay is his boss and they know, don't know the hierarchy, right? Uh, some of them may not be aware of it. And they were started appreciating it. Maybe they didn't appreciate uh, what Sanjay shared. So... In front of everyone, where a lot of senior folks are there, uh, if he feels that uh, you are more intelligent than him, uh, definitely no boss will like it. And have you read that book, uh, 40 Close of Power? Uh, it says that never outshine your master, right? Uh, so, uh, and uh, uh, like uh, when you're in this kind of situation, like sometimes we try to share our knowledge and all this, but it may end up to, it can do more damage. So what, are, what is the key takeaway from this? Key takeaways are like if we're in a situation where, like, suppose you have a lot of knowledge, talent, you want to share it differently, and uh, you have to you, you need to show it so that you get you get the project. Like, you have to be better than your peers, your colleagues, right? So that uh, uh, you you are like liked by your boss. But uh, in a meeting, suppose your boss is attending and there are other senior folks, and you started sharing a lot of ideas, you uh, uh, like and people started feeling that you have better, you are more intelligent than your boss, your boss may not feel comfortable. And that's the human nature. Very few people will uh, like that kind of uh, thing where they're looking uh, dumber or less, looking, less appearing less intelligent compared to his, uh, their subordinates. Though we say that, okay, we should build a team with a lot of competent people, definitely we should build a team with competent people. But uh, but if, you, if, if your boss looks bad, uh, then uh, it, it may backfire. Because so it's it's a tricky balance, tricky situation. So differently, sometimes you have to be look intelligent, smarter than others, and sometimes you have to see that your boss looks good, your boss looks better, right? Uh, that will help you and to uh, you know, grow in your career. You know, because if if you look uh, too intelligent, too smarter than your boss, and if your boss starts feeling insecure, it may backfire totally. So that's the uh, key takeaway uh, from this uh, story, uh, and uh, hope you like this story. And uh, please share it, like it, and subscribe the channel because I keep sharing these kind of stories. And please, uh, please do check out other stories also because there are a lot of such interesting stories on my channel. And until then, this is Avijit signing off. Stay awesome, stay positive.